Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for all sun, moon, and rising Virgos. I would like to say to each and every one, this is the month of uh, May 2017. And the month of May is fantastic. It is uh, a month where a lot of new energies vibration, but another, another money success. Um, the endings of a lot of stuff in your life. So I would like to say to each and every person, remember to listen to the general readings and also to your sun and your rising sign. It is very important because there are messages that maybe isn't in this reading that will come in the general readings. This month of May, at set, this month of May, have the energy vibration of fire we begin the uh, the month of May with the zodiac with the energy vibration of the heart and we are ending it with a zodiac vibration of the hair so the energy is going to be the devil the general energy for the month is going to be the devil and whenever the devil comes up is that there are things that we are not looking at that is important that we should take a look at okay so what is going to happen is that the energy of the devil is going to come in to um, get certain aspects and certain things align um, in the right way so it is good it is going to be extremely good it's going to be wonderful because a lot of stuff are going to be aligning um, in the cosmic way you know sometimes the pl planets are retrograde they are aligned back ways and they're going back ways so that sort of a thing okay as we look forward your energy and focus for this month um, this month is going to awaken and let you see your enemies your enemies or people who dislike you or people do not carry the same energy vibration as yourself people who wish you no good this sort of a thing that sort of an energy is going to come out for some people you're going to become extremely psychic for some people you're going to learn to connect with the unseen world the spiritual world the cosmic beings um, for some people um, who are in the fourth energy vibration is going to want to um, you know um, focus on the consciousness of who they are as a true spiritual being so there's so many different sort of a thing that is going to come out for you um, Virgo people in this month and it's going to be extremely wonderful the month began the two first week you have the zodiac energy vibration of the urge energy in the last two weeks you have the zodiac energy of the hair energy so in the first two weeks it's going to be fantastic and this is so true because the energy and vibration that is in the first two weeks and it's going to be excellent because what is happening is that um, you will realize that a wonderful experience and things are coming in I'm sorry <laughs> as we begin the month of May we have the energy vibration of the general energy vibration for of the lovers follow with your own energy vibration of the eight of Pentacles and as Virgos you carry the energy vibration of the eight of Pentacles and this is extremely good because what's where is happening between you and a loved one and this is more of a business aspect for you guys this is more of a business aspect the mo the first week is going to have a connection of um, people connecting with you in the first week and it's going to bring in it's as if you are um, working on your own uh, for some people and you're a freelancer and you're going to connect to wonderful groups and by connecting with these groups you're going to understand and this connection is going to bring you a lot of abundance in your life so this is extremely wonderful okay um, another thing um, for the Virgos if you're you are um, you know looking for a relationship try and connect with your own 
earth's earth earth sign people so if you're a virgo and you're looking for a relationship and a relationship is um, going to come up or you're looking for the right person in a relationship this month uh, that your own earth sign is the best let's look for a, a, a Virgo a Capricorn or a Taurus okay um, because this is what is going to help you in your love relationship so a lot of you will be um, connecting with your own earth sign energy um, in the month of um, in the first week of May and this is going to be extremely good because uh, it's as if the universe wants you guys to connect okay let's see what the universe have for the chakras in the first week uh, contemplation contemplation so um, whenever the red energy comes up it has to do with your um, base chakra so your base chakra needs to be ill call upon Archangel Gabriel supervisor of tone and element master fire fire Solomon and the fire dragons to touch open and activate and heal your base chakra okay because your base chakra you need to work on your big base chakra in the first week of May as we move forward and I'm listening and I'm looking at this energy whatsoever is happening between you two the lovers is in time of healing your financial situation okay so if you are experiencing a lack of financial situation you're going to heal this you're going to heal the lack of whatever is is, is vibrated on a low energy and frat universe I'm calling upon the universal angels to step in and heal my financial situation because whenever the base chakra is that your energy level to create and uh, um, to have uh, the power to move and look for something is a little bit low some people needs to walk more that sort of a thing but frack Archangel Gabriel to touch open and activate your base chakra okay ask them to touch open and activate your base chakra as you know I'm always changing up my readings and the next message that I have is the energy of the Sun so you have the energy of the Sun in the first week and this is wonderful whenever the Sun whenever you're having a, a problem with your chakra system call upon um, the Creator and the Sun and ask the Creator to place all the colorful rainbow rays golden ray in your aura and cleanse your aura cleanse your aura of whatsoever is going on okay it is a, a, a very important but whatever is happening um, with your chakra especially your brace chakra your financial situation in the first week it's going to get better it's going to be okay as we move on we are looking at the second week the second week we have the energy vibration of uh, um, a fire energy the general energy is a fire energy and you have uh, the four of Pentacles so here we are again with the energy vibration of um, money the materialistic um, efforts and so and this is good because uh, with inner strength you are going to bring balance to your financial situation whatever that was out of balance with your financial situation it's going to be ill and by this healing it is going to bring forth wonderful new important energies vibration but yet still wonderful new um, situations is going to come in your life so this is extremely good I'm loving the energy for this because whenever in a strength met the four of Pentacles come that is well a good deserve energy vibration so I'm asking 
um, my guides and angels show me what is the energy for the chakra for you guys it is the energy of orange orange and it says guilt and whenever you find yourself in a position of guilt because you're trying to save some money because you're trying to um, make sure that your situation is secure and you feel that sort of a way that's you don't have to you don't have to just think about um, healing the situation healing the situation that is happening and understand that with that sort of a thing you will create more um, space more energy more stuff around you that is going to help you to move you towards something much better into your life so be aware of this and this is going to be extremely extremely good well as again seems to be as again I'm working the other energies to see that is going to be a focus for the second week isn't that beautiful yes it is okay for some people it's all about business it's all about connecting with other people that it's going to take you to so it can be in work and for the people who are studying it's going to be wonderful if you take exam before or in the second week it's going to be wonderful um, people connecting a uh, love relationship um, certain um, relationship is getting stronger extremely stronger um, you're connecting more with certain committee and organization which is extremely extremely good so in the sense of business good business partners are going to come come in so um, I see here you have guilty but you know you don't have to be guilty about anything in your life because what is happening is that the partnership that's for, are about to come in is going to help you to vibrate at a, a total different energy vibration and the guilt will no longer be there because this this is a very beautiful card I mean in whatever sense you read this card it is all about the connection the passion that um, two people will bring in something either their relationship either their business or what's to have a negotiation if it's also a study group but whenever the energy of the ring comes up it's always partnership huge the sort of a partnership that is going to connect so have don't be feel guilty about anything in your life accept where you are on your journey and know that is the reason that you are here on this journey okay so this is wonderful what is so beautiful and this month of May is so beautiful for you um, um, Virgos because the Empress and the Emperor the Empress is here so your third week is going to be one very beautiful week if you have were having problems in shouldering a lot of burdens these burdens are going to fall because uh, the energy vibration of the Empress is here and she is going to bring um, and release you and bring you to something which is so beautiful to somewhere else so this is wonderful this is the time when we are going to change um, all that we're doing and dealing with in this time and we're going to have a wonderful new experience coming in our lives the third week is going to be a magnificent week for you guys because whatever um, burden you have been carrying and whatever burden you have been feeling you're going to realize that this burden is just going to be disappearing it's going to be dissipating chakra you should work on and the color you have is the color yellow and um, you have miracles oh my god you Virgos oh my gosh thank you you Virgos miracles this is wonderful this is good this is fantastic congratulations the energy vibration of the yellow 
um, we have the conscious energy of the yellow and this is going to help you this is going to help you the yellow is Archangel Uriel and you know you have the Sun in the first week and you have the color of yellow in the third week and this is what I've said is that whatever burden that you were carrying whatever that you feel was so um, heavy on your shoulders it's going a miracle is going to come and heal this a miracle the universe has created something beyond your wildest imagination that is going to come and release it okay and this um, energy and this miracle it's going to be wonderful because what is going to happen is that wonderful new experiences is going to come in your life and it's going to make magnificent changes Archangel Uriel um, carries the, ye the yellow um, ray and this is a wonderful time to connect with him and to call him up and ask him I'm asking Mother Father God so great in the universal angels um, for divine protection and also ask um, the angels and guide um, to place you in an only bubble of angelical light this is extremely wonderful especially when the yellow ray and the ray of the Sun comes in I want to see what else we have for you we have a hand to um, a horrible situation an end to an horrible situation a miracle has been offered and an end is going to come to an horrible situation so you know what's whatever that was happening around you be aware that the universe sometimes when you call upon the universe and you ask the universe um, for a new job this or something better the universe will grant you it's 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 a card like this you have been asking and um, you know it just come that all that was happening come to an end drastic end and nothing and this is it I told you that with the energy vibration of the moon and this cross it's going to show you who your enemies are who people who are not vibrating at the high energy vibration people who are not uh, are pretending to be who they're not the situation is going to come to an end okay Wow this is fantastic as we move on to the fourth and last week we have the energy vibration of the Kaiser the um, the Emperor and the energy vibration of the Emperor is a wonderful wonderful energy because the Emperor is bringing stability balance achievement success but yet still it is coming in very very hard and it is bringing someone the the princess of Pentacles in so whoever this um this emperor is he is going to work with the princess of Pentacles so you guys and especially the younger age if you're 21 and older this is going to be extremely good for you guys in this week 21 and over this is going to be extremely good for you guys in this week because what is happening is that with the energy vibration of um, these two energy these two people you are going to see a wonderful you become and how you're going to vibrate at the energy vibration a higher energy vibration it is a wonderful um, week it is a week where a lot of healings is going to take place but yet still wonderful magical things let's see what the universe wants to tell you um, Virgos about the fourth week instinct instinct whatever it is listen to your instinct listen to your instinct take the time and listen to your instinct in the fourth week so as I've said the moon 
can awaken some of your instincts up. This not everyone, but some. The moon can awaken your instinct up. So in the fourth week, whatever you do, listen. Listen to the instinctual messages that is coming out. Um, that your energy vibration is this month is the moon, and the moon is really a psychic, energetic sort of a um thing. And this moon is going to cleanse and move certain aspect away from you. Okay, so this is going to be extremely good. I'm calling up my mother, father, God, soul, creator, and the universal angels um, for divine intervention in what the situation is going on in your life. And you're going to see magical, wonderful challenges, changes coming in. Next energy I have for the moon is that the cloud, whatever negative aspect, whatever negativity that people were sending you, as, as if the universe source creator came in with the cross in the first in the third week and it's blocking and it's clearing up this energy okay so this is going to be an extremely the two last week is going to be cleansing it's going to be cleansing it's going to be a week of where cleansing is coming in and this cleansing is going to um, release you and let you become um, wonderfully um, anointed with the energy so this is going to be a wonderful week uh, a wonderful month I constantly said week a wonderful month and this month we're going to realize how very important it is to understand how far we are on our journeys because this month is going to show us things that we weren't aware of because once the energy of the sun and the ring comes out the sun and the ring is great relationships um, signed contract um, great relationship signed contract successful okay so great relationships sign contracts and successful what is going to happen um you know with some um it's going to be as if um difficult relationship painful and painful relationships so some people will have success in their relationship some people will have difficulties in their relationship okay and it it does happen um it does happen because some people can make things harder than they normally are okay and so difficulties will come in and then you're going to feel guilt and depression so whatever is going on if the devil is the is the energy the general energy for the month and uh, whatever is going on there is a second time guilt come up for you guys and you know you know guilt you cannot vibrate on the energy vibration of guilt what are you guilty of you know that sort of a thing and you need to understand that you need to let go of certain aspect of yourself and understand that transformation must come in certain things must come in so that you can clear the energy and break the energy so again for the chakras um compensation um, guilt uh, miracles and instinct so in the fourth week and it's so it says the month begin and bring in the Sun and it keeps on breaking down stuff and breaking down stuff and that's good so whatever guilt you have guilt and depression I have no guilt and depression because everything is going to be okay everything is going to turn out um, fine it is going a time when we need to understand that we need to clear certain aspect and certain situation in our lives okay so be aware be understanding with each other know where you are on your journey and understand that we need to accept the things what we can't change and I want to say to each and every person out there it is going to be a wonderful month the 
Eight of Pentacles, the Four of Pentacles, Ten of Wands is the end of situation, um, um, end of situation that was in your life, and then we have the Princess of Pentacles. So whatever is happening there, especially for the people twenty-one years old and older, it's going to be good. Love is in the air, but it's all about working, connecting with the right people, the right people and places. That's what is happening for you and it's going to be okay okay it's going to be wonderful you have nothing to worry about it's going to be extremely wonderful so i want to say to each and every person namaste until next month